505 right now, and it's a winter wonderland at Aloha Stadium, and it's giving back to our community through this holiday season. That's right. Get ready to be amazed because Dallas on the joins us live from Aloha Stadium with all the glowing details. Morning, Dallas. Good morning, Christine Ross. Oh, yeah, we're talking about the show Aloha Land, a winter wonderland presented by Mira Image Construction LLC. And we're joined by the founder of the show Aloha Challenge. This is Mike. Good morning, Mike Gangloff. How's Good it going? Good morning, Dallas. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm yeah. so excited that we're here. So let's go ahead and yeah, jump in the car because I want to give our viewers a little bit of a preview of what they can expect here at Aloha Stadium until January 1st. All right, I think we're safe. So let's go ahead and start this experience right here. So first, Mike, I want to ask you, how excited were you to bring this back to Aloha Stadium for the second year in a row? I'm very, very excited considering all the laughter and joy and families coming together and, and, and bringing happy times. Super excited. Started doing it right now. It even looks a little bit bigger. Are there any changes compared to last year? The tunnels that we're entering in right now are twice as long as they were last year. So these tunnels are 300 oh. feet long. Oh and, my god! And gosh. you can see, in the, at the end of the tunnel, we have more trees. We have 140 trees. Last year, we only had uh, 40 trees. We have 120 trees this year. Wow! I mean, just seeing all these LED lights. I think I saw on the website that there's 2.5 million LED yeah, lights. Yeah, I stopped counting after 2.5. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just thinking how next year would look like, and you know, I know some of you viewers are thinking, "What's that radio in the background?" Well, when you come over here to the Winter Wonderland experience, everything that you're seeing is actually synced up to 88.7. Now, how did you make that work, Mike? So we have three antennas uh, around the uh, uh, around the stadium that broadcast on 88.7 from our computers uh, in the Mega Tree area. Wow. Okay. Okay. And that's something that kind of happened last year too. Similar experience, right? Yes, similar experience. Okay. Yes. And you know, a big part of this experience is giving back to our community. I heard that you gave just thousands of dollars to local charities last year. Can you tell us really quick about that? Yeah, we gave uh, we gave her we gave around a half a million to charities last year. A half uh, a uh, this this year we 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 cut a check uh, last week to make a wish to Trini Kopuiki for a hundred grand uh -huh. to grant eleven wishes this year. Uh, oh, that's beautiful. It's all about giving back to charity. Whatever we make, we give back. That is just beautiful right there. And you know what? We're going to hear more about the great work and also the amazing experience of the Winter Wonderland here at Aloha Stadium. Remember, it's a second annual with the show Aloha Land and also the challenge that has us going for the holiday season. So stay with us. There's more to see here on Wake Up Today. And of course, if you want to go ahead and book your ticket already, visit our website at khon2.com. We have the information for you. Reporting here at Aloha Stadium, Dallas and Veros, KH2 News, working for Hawaii. Thank you very much, Dallas. And thank you to our photojournalist, Bob Kramer. Thank you so much, Bob, for showing us these <laughs> live scenes. Because I tell you what, filming and going in a cart mm -hmm. live, it's not easy, not easy. But Bob, thank you so much. Did a great job in Dallas as well. That's why he's the professional. The professional. <laughs> Getting a little dizzy, though. <laughs> but